Right learners, good day and welcome to today's video in which we are uh, continuing our series on percentages. This time they want us to calculate the original value. Okay. And we are going to be given the new value and we are going to be given the percentage. Okay. So let's start out with a simple example. Uh, let's take the example of a slab of chocolate. So let's say this chocolate is going to cost us 18 rand and 40 cents and that is including VAT. Okay. And they're telling us that VAT is 15%. So now they're saying if this is the price of the chocolate including VAT, what is the price of the chocolate excluding VAT? Right? And we have two methods that we are going to use. So with method, method number one, sorry. method number one, we are basically going to say, well, we're looking at our price, right? Our price excluding VAT, that is going to be represented by P. So I'm going to say P and I'm going to multiply P by 115%. Okay, why is that? Because the 100% represents that value and the 15% represents the VAT. So, so why 115%? Because the 115% Well, why 115% you may ask? Well, it's simple. The 100 of the 115% over here would represent the original amount and the 15% represents the VAT. So together that would make my 18 Rand 40. Okay. So how are we going to do this now? We're going to take our P and we're now going to say equals and we're going to divide. We're going to take our 1840 and we're going to divide that by that percentage. 115 and that's going to end up giving me an answer of 16 rand please just remember in method number one the reason why i'm dividing by 115 is because in order for me to move this 115 over to the other side i have to divide the side by 115 which means also what i do to the one side i have to do to the other so when I divide this side, if I do this P times 115% and I say, well, I'm going to divide that by 115, that cancels out. I'm left with P and then on this side with my 1840, I've got to divide that by 115. And that is how I then get to that. So please don't get confused when you see this. Do remember. Um, in order to move things across, we have to divide and what we do to the one side, we have to do to the other. The other way we can do this um, is through one of the other methods. And you can see this one is similar to what we did earlier. 18 rand 40. We're going to say that is 115%. But we don't know what the 100% is. So what did we do in our previous examples? We took the 100%. And we said we're going to divide that by 115%. And then whatever that answer is, we are going to multiply that by our original amount, 18 Rand 40. And we'll get 16 Rand. So 115% over year and over year, it's the original amount plus the VAT. 